Most people have met or encountered someone that has the same name as them. I know I have multiple times. And this led me to look up a statistic. Did you know that one in every 21,279 Americans are named Grayson? That means that there are a lot of Americans named Grayson. However, there's only one Grayson Moore, and that's me. In this speech, I'm going to tell you a little bit about my life's journey and my future plans. By the end of this speech, you will know me and how my life has transformed from failure to success. The past is the past, and sometimes it is important to forget the past in order to be successful. And this is where it begins. I was born in Dallas, Texas, November 25th, 1994, to Robin and Randy Moore. I also have a sister named Chandler, who's a little bit older than me. We both went through the RISD system and both graduated in the tops of our classes at J.J. Pierce High School. From there is where my life went down the drain. From there, I went to Ole Miss. At Ole Miss, all I wanted to do was party. I went to Ole Miss on an impulsive decision because that's where I thought would be the best fit. And it turned out not to be. After partying so hard and not going to classes, reality finally struck. I had to come back to Texas and not be in school, which forced me to work. But work was probably the best decision that I ever made. After accepting the fact that I had failed and made realizations in my life, I was finally on the track to success, and that is thanks to ACES. Currently, I work full-time at ACES, where I'm a property manager and project manager. As well as ACES, I attend a Brookhaven College. This is my second semester at Brookhaven, and I plan on graduating in May. I'm going to graduate with an associate in science with a focus in business. My journey is going to continue at UNT. As of yesterday, I have finally signed an apartment lease and officially enrolled at the University of North Texas for fall 2017. My goal at the University of Texas is to get a BA in either marketing or entrepreneurship and graduate by 2019. After UNT, I plan on being employed full-time and hopefully work for a Fortune 500 company and then eventually own my own business one day, hopefully in the construction or fitness field. Let me conclude. After hearing the speech, it is evident that I have changed my life around from going to Ole Miss and failing to being successful in life and enrolling at the University of North Texas. I told you about my past at Ole Miss, my present at ACES in Brookhaven, my future at UNT, and what my future career goals are. And now, I want to leave you with a quote that really meant something to me. Winston Churchill once said, success is not fatal, failure is not fatal. It is the courage to continue that counts. Thank you.